So today we're going to address a very common problem that happens to everybody, and that is a dreaded flat tire. So <clears throat> what you're going to need is some tire levers, a new tube, and a pump. So the first thing you want to do is uh, find the valve stem on the tire, put that at the bottom, and then you're going to use your tire levers <clears throat> to open up one side of the bead on the tire. So you're just going to kind of scoop it in here, open it up, and then you can hook it on the spoke all the way around and open up the tire. You can pull the old tube out, and take your hand and you just kind of rub it through the inside of your tire just to make sure that there's nothing stuck in there. Take your new tube, open up the valve, and then you just want to put a little bit of air in the tube so that it kind of takes shape, sort of like that. Then you're going to go find the hole of the valve hole and start by putting the valve in first. And then if you're, if you're new at it, it's easier sometimes if you lay it on the ground and then what you want to do is work the tube into the tire all the way around. And then once you do that, you're back at the valve. Then you're going to start working the bead of the tire back into the rim. And you just want to make sure that the tube, as you're doing that, the tube gets uh, shoved up onto the tire. Kind of use the palms of your hands to roll the bead back on there. You have to put this guy on here. Now, we can put the air in the tire. And for uh, a road tire like this, 100 to 110 PSI is good. Mountain bikes, uh, like 35, 40 PSI, depending on what kind of riding you're doing. And that is it. That is how you change the tire.